all started when I was 10 years old. I read a story on foster children and how they have to transport their belongings in trash bags and how they lose their belongings often. And here we have people in our community who want more and more and more and then there's these poor foster children who are trying to save everything inside their little trash bags that they carry around. My name is Cassandra Gonzalez. I am 13 years old and I have an organization called Good Night Sleep Tight. Good Night Sleep Tight is an organization that benefits foster children. Uh, we design pillowcases and stuff them with goodies for the foster children. I feel very fortunate to have such great friends and family and know that everyone is caring about me and it makes me want to help out others more, especially the foster children, because a lot of times they don't have close family or they might not have any at all. I was hoping that if the pillowcase would make them feel special about themselves and more secure and everything, because if they've had a rough childhood, this could always brighten up their day and make them feel extra special. I am an only child. My father left when I was 10 days old and I have had no contact with him since then. When I think about the foster children, I do think about how easily it is for something to happen to your parents. And as my mom, if something were to happen to her, then I could have very easily been placed in foster care so I can relate to them very much. When you're in foster care, you obviously think that Nobody cares about you, or that when somebody gives some, when somebody gives something to us out of the kindness of their heart, so that they care, that that means a lot to us. I thought that I definitely wanted to make a difference in the foster children's life, so I told my mom my idea about the pillowcases, and she thought it was a great idea. At her 10th birthday party, Cassandra and her friends decorated pillowcases as a party game. Doing this gave her the idea that she could help foster children by decorating pillowcases for them. And so Cassandra decided to start an organization, which she called Good Night, Sleep Tight. I called the Department of Social Services. I told them the idea of my project, Good Night Sleep Tight, and explained how I was hoping everything would work. And the girl was actually in complete shock that I was only 10 years old and coming up with this idea myself. Basically, Cassandra does everything herself. I am just the cab driver. She makes all the phone calls. She organizes the deliveries. She calls the different groups to organize whatever age group is going to be partaking in making the pillowcases and stuffing them. Oh my God, how are you? Well, how are you? Cassandra, this is so great. Thank you. How many did you do this? Um, it was about the average delivery, 50 pillowcases. Many children my age, we all do it inside the school systems. All these schools do it, the high school, the middle school, and the elementaries. I think it's a very good program and she does a lot to help other people, which is good. It's very fun to do. It's, you're, it's for a great cause and just, it does make you feel really good about yourself when you do this. The stuffed animal that we put inside is for security whenever they're feeling lonely or upset. We also put journals inside of the pillowcases so that they can write down their thoughts. Finally, we include writing utensils. We are going to be going in 
into precious memories preschool to be doing the pillowcases with the children. I thought that this would be the perfect opportunity to get them involved. My organization is Good Night Sleep Tight and it's for foster children. How old are they? They are all ages. I explain everything, but sometimes they have really good questions. Cassandra uses her speeches as a way of informing people about the needs of foster children. For Cassandra, educating people about foster care is a major part of what Good Night Sleep Tight can accomplish. After I tell them what a foster child is, they think it's absolutely great that they get to help these children out. This is, this is the foster child that has been there. This is Cassandra. My favorite part is getting to interact with the children and making sure that they're getting involved in the community. has been a great success. To this day, we have stuffed and drawn on over a thousand pillowcases, and it actually expands into many groups doing it, like Girl Scouts and Boys and Girls Clubs. I feel that I get to serve two purposes, because I get to help out the foster children, and on the other hand, I get to let all different ages of children know how foster children are, knowing that they're making a difference in their lives. I'm going to put my hair 